Lagos clergyman, the general overseer of Christ Holy Mountain International, House of Prayer for All People, Apostle Sadiq Moses, has declared a one-day interdenominational prayer summit for Nigeria. The clergyman said a second prayer summit, scheduled for Friday, October 19, is for divine protection and spiritual healing of the nation and its democracy. The general overseer acknowledged the unrest in parts of the country, but declared only God can fix it. Like we usually say, Nigeria is God's own country, God's own city, um, and the challenge of each and every country has to be fixed up um, uh, by the owner of the country. And there's no challenge that continent, country, nations, people have that they don't have a head. I'm not talking about our leaders. I'm talking about God, who is the head of all leaders. So Nigeria, challenges we will see in Nigeria has to be taken care of by God and not by man. The reason why leaders are actually finding it difficult to do what is right, a leader that is, has not submitted to a higher authority will not be able to handle any, or to handle any situation that has to do with the country, people, or organization. You must be ready to humble yourself before, before, like the Bible say, that God resist the crowd, or the proud, and give grace to the humble. Now, I think the reason why the leaders could not be able to like take care of the situation, like the corruption we have in the country, is. I believe one or two of these leaders might have received message from one or two people in the past before, be, before becoming a leader. That, hey, one, one day, someday you're going to be a leader. Be from their spiritual leader or people who, had, who they were looking up to before becoming um, a leader. I think maybe if you stop looking at the, your role model or someone who has actually shown you the way before, from the moment you, start, you stop looking at this way, you will stop looking at your destiny. I think there's something they used to look at before. They are, no longer, they are no more looking at that thing. From the moment you stop looking at God, you start looking at the world. And when you start looking at the world, you start falling. He offered invitations to men of God and spiritual fathers across the country to come together in unity and rescue the nation from the hands of the devil. The only way out of this predicament or situation or seasoner problem we are passing through is God. I see it as a season and I'm assuring you very soon this season of trouble or trauma will end. But we have to submit to Jehovah first. That's why I'm calling for prayer summit. That prayer summit is actually coming on the 19th of uh, October. I'm calling on all, on all the men of God all over the world. Um, like last time I mentioned their names and I even sent some letters across, um, across um, Nigeria to all the men of God that uh, God is calling all the men of God to come together and intercede uh, for Nigeria. That, that is the only way Nigeria is going to come out of whatsoever predicament they're passing through. So the only way out is prayer. Apostle Sadiq said the program became necessary following the unfolding insecurity drama in the country, which had become an embarrassment and constituted a threat to democracy. The clergyman appealed to all church leaders to mobilize their members nationwide for the program in the interest of the nation's growth. He said the program would enable Christians to seek the face of God concerning the social and political state of the nation and for a peaceful conduct of the 2019 general elections. To gather up the whole nations, uh of the world to pray for them, to intercede for them, to come out of a, a um, different situation they have. And um, the Bible says in Psalm 133 that people cannot be able to achieve in building a house organization or a company except they come together. On TV News recalls that the man of God had earlier declared July 20, 2018 for National Prayers Summit. The last prayer we want to pray now. If you need deliverance, pray this prayer now. Because as our men of God are having this separate deliverance worldwide from God, not from us. We are too small. I see a bit of this unit going. Yes. Speak of a lot of mocking, abusing him, 